Greetings in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. My name is Pastor Johnston Sacco coming to you live on the scripture prescription this morning. I want us to pray that we'll listen to the voice of the Lord. Father, we thank you, we bless you, we thank you because of your loving kindness, we thank you because of the grace that is available this morning. Speak to us, Lord's name. Amen. This morning, I'd like to speak about the loading test. Every time you put on your phone or you put on your laptop, or your computer, it does what we call a startup test. It checks whether every functionality of the equipment is working, and then it's able to blow the screen wide open for you to be able to access, put in your passwords, and then do what you have to do. In other words, if the system does not boot, you're not able to use that equipment for the work that you want to do. Praise the Lord. Now, yesterday we had a performance meeting with my supervisor and he brought out an analogy that I would like to bring to you. He said, the most important point when you're flying a plane is actually takeoff and landing. Once a plane has taken off, and also then you think about how you're going to bring this thing down. Those are the two important processes in terms of flying the plane. It would not matter to the pilot when he's flying up the plane, take off, then you tell them, oh, the door to the loo is not locking, or, you know, I don't have a, a, you know, a cover, you know, or I need to eat right now. Those things would not matter to the pilot. What is important and key, it is taking off the plane and landing it. So you must understand and appreciate what are the most important things you ought to do in a process. On this platform, I've spoken before about the Pareto Principle, the 80-20 rule. Now, I read the Bible in the book of 1 Corinthians chapter number 10 and verse number 12. The Bible says, Therefore, let him who thinks he stands take heed lest he fall. No temptation has overtaken you except such as is common to man, but God is faithful who will not allow you to be tempted beyond what you are able but with the same temptation will also make the way of escape that you may be able to beat it. Praise the Lord. So every day, every time, we must undertake the loading or startup test. You must look at your life, and we have been discussing in the spiritual context how we need to apply the SWOT analysis. You must check out your life. You must check up your strength your weaknesses, your opportunities, and your threats in your life. Bible tells us, therefore, let him who thinks he stands, let's take heed, lest he fall. So even the people who think they are strong at a thing, they can fall from the same position that they stand in. And therefore, it is imperative, it is critical that we take the loading test or the startup test to check every aspect of our life, to think that every functionality of our system is working. Because if you do not start up properly or load, it is not possible to apply the equipment in the best possible state. A laptop that will not start is useless. A phone that will not boot is useless. All these things work only when they have done a test on themselves and they have given themselves an affirmative vote that is possible now to venture into the work. This morning, I urge each one of us to take a loading test, a startup test for our spirituality, just to know that every organ is on this particular place, I have an opportunity, and on this particular place, I have a weakness. Have you not had people who are so good, they are full of love, but they are impatient. Have you not had that people? Have you had people who are so good, so loving, but they are not generous? Have you had people who are good people, but they don't take any rubbish thrown in their way? They have no long suffering. They cannot entertain some things. You must do a sort of analysis against yourself compared or from the scripture that talks about the fruit of the spirit. That is what I came to speak to us this morning. Take a loading or a startup test. May the good Lord be with you. The good Lord bless you. The good Lord move with you in everything that you do for the glory and honor of his name. Let us pray. Father, we thank you and we honor you this morning. We give you glory. Every time you have spoken to us, we are challenged to do the right thing. For this reason, 
We ask that our Father, you hold our hand. That even as we carry out the loading test in our lives, Father, we shall boot and therefore effectively load and work according to the grace that is available to us. This is our prayer in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. The good Lord be with you. The good Lord bless you. This has been your host and your servant, Pastor Johnston Sacco, coming to you live on the scriptural prescription, your daily morning dose of the word of our Lord.